Galveston police investigating one of their own tonight after a sergeant crashed into a car, killing the 52 year old woman who was driving it. The crash happened last night off Broadway and Christopher Columbus Boulevard while a sergeant was responding to a call. KPRC 2's Corley Peel spoke with the woman's family. Moini's family tells me she was only a mile away from work at UTMB when that crash happened. And one of their main questions tonight is if the officers' lights and sirens were activated at the time of that crash. This crash scene is what Patsy Trost saw outside her window Wednesday night. I heard this loud sound, very loud and my cat bolted. Tro says she saw this Toyota Camry that police say Mendana Moini was driving. She says it was hard to tell that the other car belonged to a Galveston police sergeant, Christopher McNeil. Why well, I wasn't sure it was a police car because there were no lights flashing. There was no siren and I thought that is really, really strange. Investigators say Sergeant McNeil was responding to a call involving a man with a gun making threats at a drugstore on the other side of town. Moini's family members say she was on her way to work at UTMB when the crash happened. She made it to work, but only as a patient, where police say she died at the hospital. Something sudden like that is so terrible for our family. Trost hopes Moini's family can get answers about the crash. I have been in contact with DPS this afternoon asking if the officers lights and sirens were activated or if there was any video. They couldn't answer those questions directly because this is an ongoing and active investigation. But we, of course, will keep you updated as we learn more. Reporting in Galveston, Corley Peel, KPRC 2 News. All right, Corley, thank you.